faith in human nature is irrepressible and even under the circumstances of a most adverse character. Gandhi, Young India, January 1st, 1920. I would say that there can be no nonviolence without some degree of that kind of faith. Now, Gandhi's faith was irrepressible because he actually had peered into the depths of human nature, namely in his own heart and soul. And you very quickly reach a point when you do that where you know that you're not just seeing your individual self, but you're seeing the energy, the consciousness, the love and beauty that exists in everyone. So he had seen that firsthand. Whatever happened in the outside world could not negate that vision once you had seen it. So what this does is creates a strong tension between the, well, let me use the word misery that we see around us in the outside world and the incredible potential that realizing the true nature of a human being could bring us to. We could say a lot more about this, but I think I have a feeling it's going to come up in various forms again and again. <laughs> 